Thank you. Yeah. I'm forgotten. How? Rudia Kiri. I've remembered. I've remembered. Oh. I've remembered. oh. You asked about goons. The goons are owned and hired by the government through their party UDA. The moment you see people saying, because the other side has given a notice for demonstration, we have a counter demonstration. That's euphemism that we will meet you with goons. If you look at this last week, for more than four days, people demonstrated peacefully in Kisumu, in Migori, in various parts of the country. Even yesterday, the demonstrations in Kisumu were so peaceful, including taking a coffin to a police station, and the police were not rattled. Where the violence occurred, these were goons. And we noticed that in the previous two weeks, there was a, a center opened, which I take was a command center for Dagari, under the auspices of UDA office. Any serious investigator will see where that violence in Kisumu came from. It was not from our members. I would also want to say this. In any country where leadership accepts and practices democracy, once a notice for demonstration is given, the police become facilitators, not obstructors. And in any period in this country, even before the passage of 2010 Constitution, I do recall times in government, demonstrators were escorted on horseback. No looting, no violence. Violence occurs where police go out on instructions to meet demonstrators with the use of unnecessary force. And that is what has happened. Protesters do not have a monopoly of instruments of violence. That remains with the law enforcement agencies. That's why we are commending the many police officers who showed restraint, but cautioning the ones who deliberately broke the law that we shall deal with them in accordance with the law and we have given instructions to our lawyers now that i have again the second one has disappeared can you quickly the march to state house may i say this that uh, as citizens and if you read the constitution we are entitled to march to any government premises government means our premises for which we fund with our 